Hello everyone, welcome to the Ichimoku.co daily futures market review for the trading day ending Tuesday, September 20th. Looking firstly to the bonds, US 30 year bond futures, and here we see the market attempting to rally but finding strong resistance at the 166.21 level and above this 165.27 region. Um, this area above 165.27 has held a strong resistance for the past week or so, and that followed very strong selling on a breakout down through the uh, Ichimoku cloud. We still have a bearish market in all three time frames, supported by the chicken span. Uh, the market is attempting to mean revert back towards the tanker team to find some equilibrium in the short term time frame and uh, doing it unsuccessfully because of this strong resistance overhead. Um, importantly, the Tangent Sen moves significantly lower over the next day, down to around this 166.21 level. So uh, it does suggest that the uh, potential resistance around there will be actually strengthened and uh, less of a likelihood of a breakout to the upside through there. The rejection from here today... Uh, without the Tang Ten trading there has been quite strong. And this suggests that the next move, uh, if we are seeing rejection from 166.21, if we see a very strong rejection from there, and if the 165.27 level is taken out as an area of support with a bearish breakout down below there, we could see the market testing down to significantly lower levels, possibly down to the 163 region. And just looking at the bands here with uh, the uh, US dollar, uh, sorry, with um, uh, 30 year uh, bonds. And uh, here we see uh, a retracement back towards the bands and rejection from within the bands. The market are able to close in there. At the moment in the new session, we are seeing uh, the resistance around the bands as well. A bullish close within there could see a mean reversion back towards the middle of the bands around 168.13. So watching very closely over the next couple of days. Importantly, the bands are wide and uh, that suggests that this downside activity may have ended and we could see that mean reversion take place but really the next day is going to be very very important how the market reacts around the Banty. If we do see that negative activity come into the market, strong rejection from there, we could see lower levels tested. Uh, bullish activity within the bands could see a retracement. Next to gold futures and uh, very weak and decisive trading over the last few days. Very small body candle. Market not testing through the highs of a couple of days ago around the 1321 level. A uh, lack of interest in this market at the moment. We are trading within the cloud, so a lack of direction in that longer term time frame. Watching support down at 1309. It has been important support and resistance in recent times. If we break out to the downside, we could test down to the bottom of the cloud around 1292. Uh, strong overhead resistance extending up to the kitchen center around 1335. Next to NYMEX Oil and the second last candle on the chart is the one we're analysing. That's the one that has completed trading. And we see uh, an attempt at some bullish momentum here in net terms between the open and the close. Buyers closing with control. And that's the first time in uh, quite some time, in about a week and a half, since the buyers closed with control. So it suggests we certainly could see the market trade higher. And already in this new candle we are seeing the market test up to the tanker 10 where we're seeing some rejection. So the tanker 10 trades very close to the top of the cloud, around 45.39. So watching this area very, very closely for any potential breakout. But uh, that area above uh, the 44.78 region up to the top of the cloud uh, is offering itself as strong resistance. And we are seeing a wane, uh, waning of the strong momentum that was built for the candle that just has completed trading. Importantly, we are trading within the cloud and it does suggest that we have a neutral market in big picture terms and looking for a breakout in either direction with some confirmation and some strong follow through.